<laughs> All right, Raid Shadow Legends. Polarium actually did it. They made this whole event to where you have to do so much and spend so many resources to try to get a fusion that is so ridiculous that you had to have so many things saved. Let's not forget all the grinding for all the events, all the ascensions that you have to get for everything else. And then it, it's just so tiring. Like I finished the Titan Champion event um, within maybe 12 hours of it being over with. So, and I don't work. I play this game all the time. It's crazy. The, the way they are doing this. Let's look back through here through um, these. this post that just came up for, this is just right now. They're doing a reset, and this is for the new champion, the Centurion. He's at 1,750 for summoning. Now, if the summonings are like they always have been, where they're 120 points for a Void, 500 points for a Sacred Shard, and 20 points for a um, Ancient Shard, then I'm done. I'm not going to be able to get him. Everything I've worked for for the event is over with. I will not be able to fuse and do everything. So it's just been a big, a huge waste of my time. So it is just insane. Just wanted to show you here <laughs> what is going on. I don't, I haven't really read through this and, and, and see what people say, but the official discords are pretty funny at times. Um, you, you can't really find any real information right here on general, but of course on the other ones, champion discussion, artifact stuff, other things you will get a lot of good information people will help you out there are friendly and helpful people here the moderators will help you as well so come onto the forums but the general is like all general in any discord i mean it's, it's like that all over it is just <laughs> a crazy mess and a fun one like i said at times it's really fun uh, this is crazy though they have put this behind a paywall for you to get the new fusion they, they have just crossed the line like gone over the whole new just like this company is is terrible it's a terrible company we should definitely find a new game to play because if they're going to keep doing this then there's no reason for us to stick around they're not going to appreciate our time and your money spending on this game to give us uh just a reasonable event i'm not talking for free stuff you don't need to hand things out but this is just way too much so i don't know we'll read over this i'll see in a minute when it refreshes let's see if it stays at um they, they're doing an update right now at this second so we'll see if it stays at 1750 and of course you're going to see deals pop up but i'm not going to get foley i'm not going to spend any money to try to get shards just to get foley i'm just going to basically um you know play this game out look for a new game and see what else is out there all right guys that's what I have. I'll keep doing raid videos. You don't have to worry about that. You don't need to worry about, oh, is, is he going to keep doing it? I'll keep playing. I'll keep doing videos. But we need to tell Polarium that this isn't acceptable, that we're not going to stand for this, and that we're just going to find an, all the other games. Like I've been saying in my other videos, they are all friendly. Their events are all completable by everybody in the game. You don't have to worry about this stuff. And they don't try to to do this to you and i'm not blaming polarium or the employees there you know this game is owned by aristocrat associates which is this huge gambling company from corporation from australia they are known for casino programming and casinos for um that's what they do and they bought out polarium like a year a year and a half ago so there's been so many changes at polarium and then on top of that i'm sure as you know big corporations like that all the ceos they're just these people at Polarium are answering to these CEOs. Most CEOs are like 60 year old dudes that have been, you know, at the game forever. Not this kind of game, but the business game. They've been at it forever. They've got this cush position. They make a lot of money. And all they do is make calls based on what makes profits, what makes revenue. And, you know, if you're 60, 70 years old, you're not growing up playing these games necessarily. They don't have any love for these games. They're not, you know, they own a whole bunch of companies. This is just one small piece of it. So they're not sitting there going, oh, wow, let me look at every fine detail. They want to make sure it makes money. And obviously, that's all they are worried about, 100%. So, We'll see what follows. I just wanted to get that out there. You guys have a great one. <laughs> and I'll see you in game.